Hi girls, how are you doing? Let's do another pick a card. And today is going to be what are they not telling you? So that could be triggering. And yes, I put some little bit of liner here. Yeah, otherwise I'm just white. I'm just like a, a cloud, you know, just a woo. <laughs> so I'm trying to put some definition around my eyes. Okay, anyway, moving on. Okay, still have my lip balm, you know. So you know all my secrets now, fascinating. I said we don't care really. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, let's go. <laughs> one, two, one, two. Pal number one, what are they not telling you? King of Pentacles, two of uh, Pentacles, an Ace of Swords. Wow, they're not telling you that they've been fluffing around for a while, maybe. Yeah, absolutely. And, um, you know, that two uh, of Pentacles is like, yes, no, no, yes, yes, wh whatever, hot and cold, but it's representing number eight, infinity number. So, what's it not telling you if they. They've been loving you for a long time or they feel that they're going to love you for the rest of their life. Okay, so that's quite amazing. They gained that clarity indeed. They had to go through a ten of sword to really suffer enough to understand what they are all about. And uh, that's how you become an emperor or an empress. You do not become an emperor. An empress having a, a cup of tea and a biscuit, as I like to say. You know, it's a work you need to do. It's that in-depth, okay? Very interesting very courageous to do that work but maybe they got to a point where i have no choice i have to do this absolutely correct and now we have a king of pentacle energy so male female doesn't matter we don't do gender in uh, tarot you know uh, is an idea of like um i uh, want to be stable when it comes to my uh, business to my work i like to have stability not just because it's a money uh, money helps to be free that's for sure you're less vulnerable but i like my work because I, it really defined who i am and i like to do a good job the king of pentacles is someone who wants stability in their relationship as well they have only one queen but that's it or you know male female doesn't matter you understand that so it's very very powerful i'm really loving you and you only and i see a future and i want to uh, build a future with you so what they're not telling you is how much they believe in this relationship and how far they're going. They might not tell you just yet. They will because they have that ace of sword and they're going to be you know, moving forward because it's a new beginning with a lot of clarity. They know what they want and they know what they don't want. They don't want to lose you. They want to be with you and it's for ever. And also because they like to be with you. Maybe being with you allow them to learn more about themselves, about... Uh, building a, a future together maybe building a family building a business it's about longevity here and with the pentacle of course it's even more longevity and we have quite a bit of longevity the fact that there's a sword is a mind as well so you know they have what it takes to make it a reality and they really want that longevity with you um it's a no-brainer okay so what they're not telling you they see a future with you and they're solid about it okay and they're going to make it absolutely a reality okay so part number two we're going to keep it short today as well uh, why are they not telling you the moon <sighs> queen of soul <laughs> and we have a four of cups so that's interesting what they're not telling you is quite profound because when you have the moon is uh anything that was hidden needs to come to the surface if they were not telling you how they're feeling or not telling you the full truth then they're gonna have to come out whatever happened they need to come clean okay um the moon can also be very romantic just they're not telling you they feel for you maybe you are friends maybe you are colleagues maybe you know you're not going down that road just yet however they feel very much for you and they're going to come clean and tell you all of that. Maybe they just need to tell you the full truth. They haven't tell you, haven't told you what they were feeling. They maybe told you some silly excuses and they know they better come clean because you are the lady of justice. OK, so queen of sword, of male, female, doesn't matter. You're very, very um, patient to a certain degree because they're going to reach a point is a no return. And maybe they're petrified. That you're going to find out some truth because they're weird they they wait well they're weird yeah <laughs> because they shouldn't play with the queen of Swords. no they, they're scared because they they know that if you find out then when you're going to find out you might cut them off for good so they're scared and maybe they didn't want to tell you anything that will be a little bit woo, just in case you know you react to be strong um but they feel as well they miss uh the boat the first time around they have maybe an opportunity to come clean they maybe as well had an opportunity to tell you how much they loved you and they didn't and now they think that you may have waited for long enough and you move on 
um, they may have not told you the full truth they may have been staying with someone else and not wanted to see you as the ace of cups a love at first sight as you can see mm -hmm. and maybe they feel terrible because they didn't tell you all of that or they rejected you because they were supposed to stay here but that doesn't make them happy because they manifested you and it's not for nothing they manifested you because they needed to wake up that is a true love okay so now what are you going to do about it they need to wake up they need to say to you how much they love you maybe they were staying with someone a bit comic a bit harsh and cold and really cutting because because maybe they have obligation with that person but it doesn't mean it's right it's not right for them because they obviously cannot forget you and you are there right there so they also may be trying to focus on work trying to focus and distract themselves for what do you know what i mean you start still here still here i'm gonna change anything so what they're not telling you is how much they love you maybe they also try to keep things silent so they should have told you before and then now they don't know how you're gonna react well you know the longer they leave it the more difficult it's gonna be and voila and maybe it's just to open their heart and say how much i love you what's the problem here is being vulnerable yes but it's being sincere okay on this note have a beautiful day and i see you tomorrow Mwah. ciao